friends, it's Lindsay with Emeralds and Fairy Lights, and I am so excited to show you guys this diamond painting. <laughs> it just actually got in. This was a new release that came out a few weeks ago, but um, it was a pre-order, and so it just barely got here today, but I thought it was absolutely darling. This is Robot Repair by Randall Spangler. It is a square that is 22 inches by 22 inches or 56 centimeters by 56 centimeters, which seems to be a good common size for these Randall Spangler paintings. But this was just, I don't know, there's something about this robot that is just adorable. <laughs> I could not, I just had to get it. And the colors are really fun. I think they've got some ombre colors and things like that. Um, there's so much in this little picture. We'll pull it out and look at it. Um, but this is a limited edition diamond painting. So if this um, interests you or you love it, um, this is one that you want to grab um, just because they will not be restocking it. Um, they're, they're letting you know now more kind of if things are limited edition or they're um, you know, going to be discontinued. And so this one, they let us know from the beginning that this was going to be a limited edition. So you just know right off the bat. <laughs> okay. Um, you got all of your typical things, um, in a diamond art club box. You've got your blue square that tells you this is a square diamond painting. Um, diamond art clubs, new squares are just beautiful. And I really encourage you guys to try them out if you're a little square wary. Um, <laughs> because they're beautiful. They are producing their own drills. I just have to tell you right off the bat. Um, okay, so then we've got our kit contents as well as how to diamond paint and a barcode right here or a, I think a QR code to scan. So inside we get a toolkit and this is your typical old square toolkit. They do have new toolkits. I do have a comparison video on my channel, which I can link below if you're curious to see what the new toolkits look like and an in-depth look at the toolkits. Um, you've got your tweezers, a four placer, a squishy, a pen, two things of heart wax. Um, you've got a boat right here and some baggies, all the things you need to start diamond painting. Inside the kit, you do get this little small sticker um, that you can put on your logbook or you can put it on your box to help you store it. And then of course you get your canvas in this nice bag. Um, so let's open this up and look at the drills and the canvas. I apologize if you hear if you're hearing any noise. I do have my whole family here and Gary is corralling the children, but that doesn't mean that <laughs> they don't get a little rowdy, but oh my gosh, you guys, this is so cute. <laughs> Look at this robot. There is something so cute about him. Um, let me know if you guys feel the same way or if I'm just strange, but I think he's so cute. Um, we have got our drills nicely packaged and then they do have a sticker on here that lets you know what kit if you want to store your kit and your drill separately um, some people like to do that I like to keep mine in the box you get your step-by-step -step instructions with another code in here um, you have your sticker sheet that has a large picture for you to look at of the the painting and then um, you have like a start and end date and then these stickers are individually cut so you can pull them off and kit up. It's so easy to kit up with these individual stickers. Now this one has a lot of ABs. Oh my gosh you guys look at this. So ABs are um, drills that have a special coating on them and they're usually coated in Diamond Art Club as the number is below 150. So if you look on here, you can see that there are six ABs in this kit, six. Um, we have got 100, 101, 128, 134, 135, and 141. <laughs> If you've watched any of my other videos, I really dislike 135, but I love 134, but it's cool. I think it'll work in this painting and it's just a personal thing. <laughs> now they did do this. This is, this is naughty. Um, they mixed up the number right there, you know, 
I mean, it doesn't really matter because you can just not look at the 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 serial number, I guess, or the number of the symbol. But yeah, I usually prefer that they keep that out of the top 10, but um, I think it'll just be something that um, will, I don't think it'll be too big of a deal because I don't actually see a six. So I think it'll work out. <laughs> um, it looks good otherwise. So um, this is a poured glue canvas. So if you see any wrinkles in here, don't worry. That is just the cover. This this will lay flat. Um, Diamond Art Club has these really nice velvety um, backing on their canvases. They're I would say they're they're thicker than um, some, but I would say they're medium thickness <laughs> compared to all the canvases that I have seen. Now you have these edges that are scalloped and they're poked. And I don't want to say surge because I'm like, I know what surging is and there's no, but maybe there's a different kind of surging. My experience with sewing is <laughs> um, limited to a few things. Um, let's see. So you can roll this backwards to lay it out flat. Um, but to be honest, this, this will just lay flat so easy um, really quickly if you're not in a hurry. Now you've got your legends on either side of the canvas. You have right down here a little picture as well as it talking about how this kit is legally licensed from Randall Spengler. So he is getting paid for this image um, to be released as a diamond painting, which um, is so great that Diamond Art Club supports their artists. Um, as well, there is this guarantee that if you have any missing diamonds or a problem with your canvas, um, there is that. And then of course, at the top, you have the do what makes you sparkle, which is the way that you easily identify a diamond art club painting. Um, their symbols have just beautiful clarity. Um, I have just, I've never had a problem with one of their canvases. And I'm just gonna check the stick. Very nice. I've never had problems unless I've not stored the kit right. <laughs> um, which I've talked lots about, about one particular kit that I did not store that right and it was the sticky was problems. But other than that, the kits have just been beautiful. Sticky wise. Let's look at these drills and then we'll find out where all of those ABs go. If you don't like this part, you can skip it um, to where I show you where the ABs are. So we have got 796, 317, 414, and a green friend. Looks like 699, 300, 797. 814, 890, 775, and 3847. We have got 400, two bags of 3799, one bag of 310, two bags of 3853, one bag of 498, one bag of 823, a bag of 334 <laughs> and we have got our first AB this lovely 134 I love this AB I love that green it's so pretty if you can see how it like it just extra shines we've got 762 we've got 3854 817 with a blue friend visiting 938 906 798 3848, 101, our second AB, which is this lovely blue. It's kind of like a gray blue there. 3325 and 702. Then we have got 3865, 833. Wow, this looks actually green in the camera, but this is definitely doesn't have green tones in real life so <laughs> I don't know what's going on there 891 100 um this AP is the next one 703 3855 666 141 this lovely white AB that I think just makes paintings better 
gorgeous, $8.93, $7.43, $3.68, $3.69, um, $128, looks like there's some light purples. We've got a lot of not socially distancing drills in this kit. 128, another AB. 913, 208, 597, 744, 135. This is the moss green AB. It's like, it can't decide if it wants to be a yellow or a green. Um, <laughs> 211. I know some people really like that color, so it's just me. 907, 415, 301, two bags of that, and then 318. Okay, so I have pulled out the individual um, ABs so you can see them. Oops, I actually have a one that is not an AB there. Must have fallen down in there. But here are our six ABs. We've got these three greens, yellow, a pink, a white, and a blue. So the, these two are going to be mainly in your dragon. So your dragons are gonna be really shiny. Um, this one is four and this one is one. Um, and so I will show you, there is some in the car right here. And then there's some all over the dragons. You can see the ones in the fours. Um, in this dragon as well. So these dragons are gonna be shiny. Um, there is some of the five, which is this, this lighter color. And it is going to be um, right here in the bottom. You're gonna see some of these fives um, in this little ball right here. And then up on this robot in his gears. Um, I don't really see it anywhere else. Um, I was looking to see if it's in the book at all or the, yeah, but I don't see it. Um, so that is where those ABs go. And then this blue one is number two. And you are going to find the number two um, down here in this car in the, the grill sort of area. And then down here um, in the ground in certain places, um, definitely along the car. Um, let's see if there's any in the books. I don't see any in the books, but up here, like, is this the spaceship? There's a bunch of twos in there. And there's a bunch of twos in here, in the rocket ship window. You can see that. Um, so that is the blues. And then the pinks are three and you're gonna find them in just very little accent places like right here in the car or right here in the ball. Um, there's a few right here on the buttons, on the robot and then in his hat right here, this light pink is all gonna be ABs. And then there is some on the rocket ship and um, there is a little bit right here on the, is this a rocket pack, a rocket pack or something <laughs> on the back? Or, oh no, it's the arm. It's the arm of the rocket is right here. Um, and then you have the white one, which is number seven. And seven's gonna be here in like the hydraulics of the robot. Is that what you, what you call it? <laughs> I am not an engineer or mechanical expert at all. So correct me if I'm wrong, but I think um, there's some right here down here in the whites. If you look, there's sevens down there and there's sevens down here. Um, there's sevens in the rocket ship in this white edge right here. And then there are all in the sky, a lot of these white dots, the stars are sevens. Some aren't, but a lot of them are sevens. And um, yeah, so that is where your ABs go. So um, let me know if you guys like this kit. I think it's super cute. I think it's gonna work up super cute. Um, there's just something about the robot with his little <laughs> half-closed eye. Very cute. So I will see you guys in another video. Bye!